We start though with some breaking news tonight. No more threat at Sacred Heart. A bomb squad disabled a suspicious device, which police said looked like an explosive. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Mark Hanrahan. Regina is off tonight. We begin with that breaking news. The suspicious device found outside the Sacred Heart ER. Our Casey Decker has the latest from the hospital tonight. Well, Mark, obviously a suspicious device at the region's biggest hospital, something that nobody takes lightly. That's why some roads were blocked off and the bomb squad brought in. Thankfully, after about two hours, the device was rendered safe and the ER here not significantly impacted. This all started a little before seven o'clock tonight. Someone saw the suspicious device and notified hospital security. It was just outside of the public ER entrance. Spokane police described it as cylindrical and small enough to be handheld while waiting on on the bomb squad, patients and staff were directed through a different entrance and some ambulances went to other hospitals, but the ambulance entrance and ER otherwise operating as normal here at Sacred Heart. No evacuations were required. A few roads directly around the hospital were temporarily blocked off. When the bomb squad arrived, they rendered whatever the device was safe, but I'm told it may still be a while before we know whether or not that device is in fact explosive. And as you can see back here at the hospital roads, the hospital all up and running again operating as usual this incident apparently ending without much issue reporting for the Sacred Heart Medical Center Casey Decker Crunchy News